hi guys nasumi here welcome to my channel today i'm going to show you how to make the most amazing zobo drink also known as sora or rosal drink now this tea is absolutely amazing so underrated so many amazing benefits this is medicine right here okay we're going to need our hibiscus leaves also known as zobo at the market we also need our cloves also known as konofuru we need our aromatics our cinnamon stick and ginger very important for the flavor we also need to sweeten our zobo with a ripe whole pineapple of course we need some water some honey for people that cannot withstand the sour taste of zobo and a large pot glass cups a knife and a spoon okay so let's get to it the first thing you need to do is to rinse your zobo leaves now when you get to the market look out for the ones that are a bit dark red in color the research shows that those ones have a higher vitamin c calcium and ash content okay it's okay the water turns red when you rinse it it's fine it's not going to impact the flavor of the zobo in any way so you can go ahead and rinse it very well so you can take off all the sand and the dirt that comes you know from it being stored in the market once you rinse properly discard the water it's fine you can discard the water discard the water and then place your washed zobo leaves into a large clean pot all right like so you need a pot big enough to you know take all the water we're about to add now we add your cloves because it's very medicinal and it gives it a very nice flavor as well as your cinnamon stick you can use cinnamon powder if you don't have the stick now uh, cover your zobo leaves with enough water i used about three liters for four cups of zobo now place this on medium heat and while that is heating up we need to peel our ginger and then scrub our pineapples okay if possible use iron sponge to scrub your pineapple because we're going to use the back of the pineapple we all know how medicinal this back is it also has a very distinct flavor so when you add it to your zobo the difference is always clear so yeah the main pineapple we're going to use it you know to sweeten and the back is going to be used for its medicinal benefits you still rinse again in some water and vinegar because you know we don't want any single dirt entering our zobo all right place your pineapple back into the tea and then cover now the main pineapple we're going to cut into sections the meat section will take it out and then cut into small pieces because we are going to blend this pineapple now the reason I blend my pineapple is because it makes the zobo much more sweeter. The flavors are more intense, you know, and even the ginger, blending it makes, you know, the zobo thick and gives it a very different essence. I've tried it, you know, different ways. I've put the pineapple back in the zobo and it just wasn't, that the flavors were not as intense as, you know, blending the pineapple. So if you can, blend this pineapple and you would see the difference. You end up with a very delicious, silky, you know, thick zobo. All right, bring your zobo to a boil. And once you bring it to a boil, make sure you don't cook more than 10 minutes because we don't want to, you know, destroy the vitamin C content of the zobo. Five minutes sometimes if, you know, you use high heat. But yeah, you can use a timer. And once it comes, once, you know, 10 minutes, it's, it's finished, take out the heat. And then cover your zobo and allow it to sit for two hours all right sometimes i even leave my zobo overnight because the flavors are so intense the longer you leave it to sit all right but for the purpose of this video i just did two hours just to show you how silky smooth and thick this zobo is going to be all right so you still need to run your zobo through a sieve a finer sieve or a cheesecloth even if you've used the sieve or a colander before just to make it extra smooth because some ginger bits you know are gonna be stuck in there whether you like it or not so try and run it through the cheesecloth and you'd end up with a very amazing smooth zobo see all the ginger bits it took out all right you don't want that in your zobo now our zobo is ready this drink hmm, guys for hyper hypertension anxiety diabetes this is medicine right here and adding sugar is just going to be counterproductive because we don't want this is not this is medicine all right we want to make sure every essence is you know preserved so you could serve it with ice you know and some cucumber slices cocktail style or you could drink it hot as a tea Either way, this drink is amazing and medicinal. Guys, please try it and let me know how it came out. God bless you guys for watching. Bye.